All right. So here we are. I'm trying to get this double carton drive shaft in. I need to put the yoke on. And uh, in my rush, I broke a bolt. I broke a bolt at the uh, right at the yoke. So anyway, I'm trying to get this yoke onto the uh, transfer case. I, did, I had the uh, vehicle in neutral and just trying to rush. I went ahead and neglected to put it in, you know, park, keep the uh, transfer case from spinning. So just tapping the, the handle of the uh, ratchet, I broke the bolt. And then to make things worse, I went ahead and broke a drill bit in the bolt. And uh, every uh, YouTube video I see says, oh, you're gonna have to go to a machine shop. They say you need diamond coated bits. So I'm not gonna go to a machine shop. And I stopped at Harbor Freight. They have diamond rotary bits. I'm gonna give these a try. They got left-handed drill bits. I'm gonna give those a try. They got screw extractors. I'm gonna give those a try. Now, in my career, I've done hundreds of number two screws. I've never done one this big. It's a quarter inch. So I, w I went ahead and bought two of them, just in case I, I break one. You know, I'm, I'm that determined to make it happen. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get these uh, diamond bits <clears throat> and put them in the Dremel and just start hogging into the broken bolt. And then once I get it deep enough, I'll go ahead and try the uh, extractors. I bought these uh, little T-handles. I, I own some, they're at work. I don't feel like going to work, bring home tools. I get tired of that. So I went ahead and bought some of those. These were open open box, so they, they gave it to me for $2. So that's worth it. That's worth it. Anyway, so, oh, that's for another project. But anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and give this a try. Try to get this transfer case <coughs> drilled out. Try to put that drive shaft in. There it is. That's the old one. For now, that's working. I got the new one in there. As you can see. The forward new one is in, but the aft is still the old one. I'm going to try to make it the, into the new one. See how it sticks out? That's about an inch too far. And then once the wheels drop as, you're drive, as I'm driving along, this actually comes out more. I do not want to have this come out completely that would be bad anyway so i'm gonna put this uh yoke in and get it going let's see how i do and by the way this is not a setup this is total, totally screwed up i'm trying to help you guys out show you how to how to do it and i'm i'm trying myself and i'm learning myself so we'll see how it goes all right talk to you soon